All right, we're here at Lakewood speaking with Josh Zai. Josh, just wanted to ask you, saw you out of BP in the outfield, spending a lot of time with Ryan Howard while he's here on a rehab assignment. Just uh, can you get a feel for what you guys were talking about, maybe what you picked up from him? Um, you know, I just asked him about his, uh, I guess his past, you know, like the time he spent here, the time he spent, you know, playing winter ball, you know, fall ball, just, you know, just stuff about it, you know, not necessarily just about baseball, but about, you know, living the life of, you know, a professional baseball player, and, you know, I mean, He's very resourceful. He's a very smart guy. You know, he's been through it all, and he's only 30, so mm -hmm. got a lot of a lot of time to come. So, you know, that that 10 or 15 minute stretch that you got to spend with him, you feel like that was beneficial for you going forward in your career? I mean, I don't think it's going to have any effect on how I play the game, but I think, you know, you know, just talking to him, you know, I mean, he can show that a, a superstar, you know, an all star, a major league all star, you know, is a really down to earth guy. You know, he also lives a life. You know, he's got more than just baseball to live on, so I think that's really, really important. Is there an additional level of excitement in the locker room or in the dugout when you guys have a major leaguer here doing a rehab assignment like this? Oh, absolutely. I mean, you know, it jumbles up our lineup a little bit, and, uh, you know, I mean, he's a great presence. You know, he works hard. You know, he's huge. I mean, we're getting, we're, we might have 10,000, 12,000 fans here tonight for him, you know, and hopefully of those 10,000, 12,000 fans, a few of them are new fans, and they like us after, you know. Maybe they come to a game tomorrow or the next day, so, you know. And then speaking of that that huge expected crowd here tonight at First Energy Park, uh, do you guys feed off of that that excitement level and that that uh, that volume from the crowd that you're going to have tonight with with a larger crowd here? Absolutely. I mean, yesterday was Thursday night. We had eight and a half thousand, and that was it was an electric crowd. Too bad we couldn't pull a win out, but I mean, tonight's going to be electric. And if we can win, I mean, I think that'll be that'll start. We've been struggling, but I think that'll turn us around in big time. Here with John Singleton out at First Energy Park in Lakewood. Uh, John, I saw you out hanging out in the outfield, shagging balls during BP uh, with the big piece, Ryan Howard. Just talk about that, maybe uh, what you guys were speaking about and perhaps what you picked up from him during that, that chat session. Uh, we just talked about some of his experiences here, uh, some, of his, his, some of his experiences in uh, the Arizona League. Uh, just pretty interesting to hear what he had to say and uh, what, uh, what, what he did at different levels. So. Just interesting to talk to him. You feel like that conversation uh, would be beneficial to you going forward in your career? Yeah, I mean, most definitely. Uh, gives me some things to look forward to, uh, some things to expect. So, whatever tips I can take, uh, I'm willing to take. Yeah, you know, cool. help. Is there an additional level of excitement in the locker room or in the dugout when you guys have a major leaguer here rehabbing with with the Lakewood Blue Claws? Yeah, of course. I mean. It, 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 he's somebody that, that's been there before and knows who it takes, so it's always exciting for, for someone like that to be around. So, what's the, what's the best thing about having these guys around? Like Chooch was here, uh, you know, Joe Blanton was here earlier in the year, but you missed out on that. But when you know, when Carlos Ruiz or you know, and these, these world champion players are in the house with you guys in the Lakewood locker room and in, in the Lakewood dugout and out on the on the First Energy Park field, what's the best thing about having those guys around? Uh, the way they care themselves. I mean. They've been there before, so they know what it takes, and their, their work their work ethic is a lot different than, than what you see now at this level. So that's always something that you can that you can pick up on. And then obviously, uh, teams expecting a huge crowd here tonight. Uh, you guys had a big one last night, and then uh, a lot of buzz going around about disappearance and everything like that. So you're gonna have a you know even bigger amount of fans in the crowd tonight. Is that is that something that you guys can feed off of when you got a huge home crowd right, you know, right here at First Energy Park? Yeah, of course. I mean, it's like, it's like playing a playoff game. So, you know, it, it, it definitely going to help us, I think. It'll prep you guys for a few weeks when it really is a playoff exactly, environment. Exactly, exactly. Okay, that's all I got for you.